Hello! Merry Christmas, I suppose. It's like I'm filming this on the 29th of December. So, like, it's coming to the end of 2021, and it's like a few days after Christmas. And it's the. It's like this short time window between Christmas and Christmas ending to New Year's and 2022 beginning because it's 2021 right now if you are watching this at the time of upload and all of that it's very weird filming in a new house I'm just like you know because uh, with my old house and my old setup it's so easy to just do it how I do every year so yeah I'm, I'm trying the best I can anyway so we're just going to go along with it and um, I hope you had the best Christmas ever. I hope 2022 brings you everything you want, everything you need, all of that good stuff. And without further ado, I'm going to now get on to the video. Woohoo! <laughs> so if you watch these videos that I do every year of my what I got for Christmas, I also include what I got for birthday and what I got for Christmas usually in videos except for last year because of the lockdowns making it incredibly difficult to film content and come up with content ideas and things like that. So I'm going to start off with birthday and I'm going to be going in with uh, the big one because I, I needed this for a while like um, most of you know that I needed this for a long time because my old one was old so my parents very kindly got me a 2020 edition MacBook Pro but so like the MacBook itself was for my birthday um, should be birthday and Christmas really because it was so expensive but anyway the accessories are more for Christmas but I had them early because I needed to protect the MacBook so let me just show you this is my MacBook Pro I chose like a blue and gold kind of case for it um, I just remembered when you open it it goes down it turns on so I don't want to do that but the back is all protected um, the inside has um, like a keyboard of it in fact I will show you you can see there I'm going to shut that down in a second off camera and I have a matching sleeve to go here with it I got these from Amazon. Um, the MacBook was from Curry's PC World. There's also a screen protector on the MacBook screen, which is good. So that's that helps. After that, I decided to use a gift voucher that I received from a very good friend of mine, Alita, to purchase like a USB LED mouse because dragging and dropping isn't as easy in my opinion on the new MacBook compared to my 2014 edition MacBook and other MacBooks I've had in the past so um, this actually does light up which is really cool which is also from Amazon it's the brand Seender S-E-E-N-D-A and of course Apple basically just want to make more money, like they're not um, super, you know, wealthy already, people at Apple. They replaced USB with USB-C, which is really annoying, so I got an adapter for it, and it's got like USB slots, all the things you need basically, and memory card slots. It's made by Tuwaja? Tuwajia? T U W E J I A. Because I mentioned that I used an Amazon gift card that Alita got for me, I'm going to show you that she also got me some Regen cream, which I highly recommend. It's also from Amazon, 
I highly, highly recommend this stuff. Like, it's amazing for blemishes and cuts and anything that you're having problems with when it comes to skin, it'll do everything. Like, it's, it's unbelievable. It also makes a really good moisturiser as well. I can't open it because I've made the lid, oh there you go, I've made the lid really tight. But I've used a lot of this already because it's it's so good. I mean of course, um, I asked for this from the person for my birthday but it won't be till obviously the 1st of January when I put this up. It is from my lovely HMV manager Rob. And it's 101 Dalmatians. 2022 official calendar. It's also got um, on the first page dates of 2021, just as a nice bonus. And January, it starts with like a lovely little picture of dogs. I love Dalmatians. Like when I'm older, I want a Dalmatian. That'd be really sweet. I want loads of animals when I'm older. Like so many, so many. The manager at my other job. Um, Emma, the new one, sent me a sugar glider. Um, quite a few people I talk to don't know what a sugar glider is. It's a type of animal and it flies through the air like that. And um, apparently they're known to like fight, I suppose. I don't know. I think they're pretty cool. And I was talking to her about them and she thought it'd be funny if I got um, one of those as a gift. My bestest friend Madeline, um, she got me an Amazon gift voucher because that's what I seem to benefit from the most, like Amazon. I'm always on Amazon and as much as I don't want to line big billionaires' pockets, everything is on Amazon that I want and it's just hard. Um, so she got me an Amazon voucher. Most, most of the things that I've been getting our Amazon vouchers, which I'm extremely grateful for. So Madeline also got me this amazing pin badge, enamel pin, which I asked for. Pusheen, um, collaboration with Artbox, Friendship Pip, Pip's the character and Pusheen, Pip's the little one and Pusheen's the bigger one, so an enamel pin. And um, it's really sweet, I wanted um, these because it's to signify special relationships. I think this is for birthday as far as I've been um, told but from my cousin Anastasia I got some amazing pyjamas, they're super soft. At my old house I um, I was always really hot and thick pyjamas weren't always great but with this house because I live on the top floor, for some reason it gets really quite cold up there and the dial for the thermostat is in my parents' bedroom, so if they're asleep, I don't want to really disturb them and be like, oh sorry, I need to put the heating on. It's just a bit much. So I found myself um, needing more fleeced pyjamas and just face it, who doesn't like, you know, soft pyjamas and soft things? And it says dream, plan, do, which is very me, because I'm very determined. And it's in, a, it's in a really good size as well. This is pretty much what I would wear size-wise. Right, let's move on to Christmas. I got so much chocolate for Christmas. So I'm not going to be showing most of it, because let's face it, I've eaten some of it already. You know, and there's so much of it to like round up. So like, I'm like, eh, so it's a bit difficult. Um, so I'm gonna kind of show you a few bit of um, chocolate and food bits, but not like the entire lot because it's not really that interesting, I suppose. So I really wanted these pins, the Pusheen, art box collaboration again as you saw there was the friendship one from Madeline and this one is Pusheen with mum and this one's Pusheen with dad and I love them so much and my plan is to put all three of the badges 
on the backpack I use the most so that I can take these people with me everywhere I go. So I was on the subject of pin badges and I was talking about Madeline. So for Christmas Madeline got me Amazon vouchers because as I said that's what I've been asking for the most because it's so helpful. Um, my parents got me an iTunes voucher. Our family friends Dan, Pam and their children got me an Amazon voucher. I'm trying to keep track. Alita got me an Amazon voucher and she also got me this conditioner that is so good, like I recommend it so highly. It is the Purology Hydrate Conditioner and 100% vegan ingredients anti-fade complex or anti-fade complex if you're American um, it's for dry colour treated hair so basically my hair <laughs> it's amazing put it that way it's amazing my cousin Anastasia got me a little body shop bag with products in it's um, almond milk body butter um, almond milk and honey I should say Almond milk and honey shower cream and a almond milk and honey hand cream. So there's that. Very grateful for those. Now this I bought, yes, with an Amazon voucher that I got. And I love it so much. I got this, one of these, for my HMV manager, Rob. And uh, mine is like red and blue. I like to say that it's like Spider-Man colours because it, it is. And you turn it upside down. I don't know how well you can see that, but I'm going to show you properly in another clip. But um, how cool is that? So on the subject of managers from employment, I'm not going to show everything because... Um, what this person got me, most of it is like food items like chocolate and stuff like that, but my cinema manager Emma got me some toasted marshmallow jelly belly jelly beans, which they're upstairs, I've eaten some of them, and she got me some Cadbury whole nut bites, it's so hard to remember what people get for me, um, she got me a sign that I'm gonna eventually put on my bathroom door which says warning toxic fart radiation zone because my farts are really bad like I'm not saying that I fart in the workplace I'm just saying that I've told people that they are bad and people believe me I suppose it's probably because I'm pescatarian I don't know now I haven't tried this out yet it's called a flying over pro it's meant to like spin and fly across the room it's in like um, light up as well I haven't opened it yet so I don't know if it needs batteries and stuff like that so I'm not gonna play with that our family friend Sula got me a sanctuary spa miniature set which is really cool it's body wash and body lotion as well as a body sp spray so that's going to come in really useful forgot to mention that for birthday our family friend Emily and the Elena's family got me some money for my birthday and then for Christmas I got like a white super dry snow um, type of coat that would be good for um, like skiing that would be good for skiing. It looks waterproof. I haven't um, tried it on or anything yet, but I will for sure. As It's only been like a few days um, since Christmas. My grandma, granddad and great aunt gave me money for Christmas. And my grandparents gave me money for my birthday. My great aunt, not my great aunt, yeah my great aunt doesn't usually. Yes, so what I missed out was my HMV manager got me some chocolate and what is like an amethyst. It's like one of these where you display it rather than use it for its healing properties. 
on you as such. I mean, gonna be honest, it seems more, um, what's the word? It seems for more display purposes than anything because it, even though the stone part feels real, the purple part doesn't, so that'll be just for display. So moving on to the main present that my parents got for me and just keep in mind that it was not purchased outright, just so you know, it's on contract. They bought me the brand new iPhone 13 and I bought the case for it and this amazing pop socket. My favourite pop sockets are the tide pull ones because they actually, they actually do something when you look at it which is amazing and I don't know if you can see here but um these are like protective camera rings around here because I've heard of people break this part of their phone and it's scary and also I work in retail so I saw somebody with these and I was like oh what are they and they told me oh they're protective rings for the cameras I was like fantastic so I bought some of those with the Amazon voucher, one of them that I was given recently, my parents also bought me some hot chocolate melts. They are so nice. I really wanted one of these, but I never told them that. It's a shortbread house that lights up. It's not lighting up as well as it can, but that's because there's a bag of shortbread in it that I haven't opened yet or used. Lots of hot chocolate melts. I think there's about two or three of these. A Percy Pig musical rotating tin. I'm not that big on Percy Pigs. Like, I don't usually like when people buy them for me. But at Christmas, I have them as a treat because there's a lot of sugar in these. They also got me some socks. So they're from my parents as well. And a whole bunch of chocolate that I'm currently looking at down there. Like some Whisper, some chocolate coins. Some Ritter Sport Mini, stuff like that. Please forgive me for this as Tyra bought me some things for my birthday and it completely slipped my mind. So I'm going to show you now. So these are birthday. She got me an amazing rainbow cloud bath bomb, which I've been so like wanting to use but I'm like oh I've got to film this video first so there you go it's on camera now <laughs> she got me some hot chocolate stirrers one is milk chocolate one is orange chocolate so that's amazing she got me a virtual pet I haven't put it on yet because I'm worried in case it's gonna like beep in the night and I won't know how to turn it off but I am gonna have fun with it and then finally, um, one of those fidgets, like a rainbow push popper. If I missed anything out, I'm so sorry. I'm just basically really tired and I work a lot at my real t retail jobs at the moment and it's just been um, a lot to have moving house, Christmas, birthday, um, all these things, you know, working a lot. It's, it's a lot, you know. So um, there's that. But I hope you liked my what I got for Christmas and birthday kind of haul. Just want to show you finally, I got this from myself. It's a sweatshirt with pandas on and it says kindness for all. And um, so on that note, I um, shall see you in another video and I hope you as I said, have the best Christmas, had the best Christmas ever, not have, had, and I hope that the new year brings you everything that you want and need and all of that for you. See you in another video. Comment down below what your favourite present was, because I like to know. I think my favourite present, it was obviously like the bigger things like the um, MacBook and the iPhone and blah blah blah, but I think... Other than that, it was... I was just looking at the items down here. Probably the pin badges. The little pin badges of Pusheen. Pusheen's collaboration with Artbox. I think those are my favourite. As well as the calendar. The 101 Dalmatian calendar. So, like, 
Oh, they're my favourites. But anyway, see you in another video. Bye.